Hi, I'm Ethan. I'm Nate. And our project for this nine weeks was making a stop motion animation, um, like a short movie. And our plan was to make it a spy movie, assassin kind of movie. And uh, it didn't really work out the way we wanted it to. We first thought we would have like an actual movie, but it turned out to be like more of a movie trailer type thing. We, our original idea was to set up a couple of sets of him watching who he has to kill, get a note on who he has to kill, going through the building and fighting his way through. But um, the set build took so long that we had to cut it down to us basically in, instead of just a whole movie, just bits of it where most action would come in. And it seemed right. Uh, and, and we replaced most of the uh, most of the climbing up the elevator, that fighting scene. We yep. replaced that with um, a car chase scene, and it fit in pretty well. Um, that didn't take much time, but that was our original um, plan. And like I said, it didn't work out, so we made more of a movie trailer type thing. And the equipment that we used was we used a bunch of cardboard, uh, duct tape, paint. Uh, we used um, spray paint as well to so it was quicker to spray paint the buildings. Um, once we got our whole set built, we made our people out of clay and wire, and uh, we found out that Play-Doh doesn't stay up well by itself, so we... Change that's to that's clay. where we went from play doh to clay and wire. Yeah, because clay and wire can stand up on its own. It's much easier to move around, and the clay didn't dry out yeah. as fast. Yeah. So um, we were able to use that, and um, then we uh, once we had our people made and everything. Uh, oh, what up? equipment? Sorry, uh, we used the DSLR camera. We used the tripod. Lights. We went from kind of more natural lights to uh, you like fluorescent kind of blue blue lights that are kind of nice around the eyes, but they they don't look like the sun. Those were more for just lighting, like just to add light or for night lighting. Mm -hmm. uh, we also used those lights for the inside, um, for inside scenes like when he's in the lobby, um, and then we. Uh, used Final uh, Cut Pro on yeah. the Max here. Um, lots of just different figuring out how to use it and um, we use masking was one part of it which is where you take one back part and then you choose what part, where you want that back part to show. We use that for the car chase scene and if you look through it you might not notice it at first but if you look through it enough you'll see it. Yeah, that's because we messed up and I was in the picture moving the um, cars. But uh, I found this project really fun and I learned that you need to make sure and plan for mistakes like what, what happened to us and we did somewhat. So we had time to recover and make um, a decent film. But, but make sure when you're making a four week project like we did, make sure you leave time for error and also make sure that you aren't hard on yourself and you come out because we were actually really hard on ourselves and we wanted to make it perfect but at the end we were just trying to get it done and do the best we could and it didn't turn out too bad but um just got to keep that in mind that not everything's going to turn out the way you want it um really plan to like spend some time on it because shooting it's one thing, but making it look nice is also a part of it. And then editing, that's a big part. You have to make sure that all everything that you put in looks good, and if you have to fix it, you have things to fix it with. Or you can maybe go back and reshoot. We did that once. At the very end, we reshot a scene, so that way they could see our, what our building was. And it was a better transition. Yeah. Um, also... Uh, make sure that you plan every scene. Nothing that we did was not planned. We didn't be like, we weren't like, oh, we're going to 
just do this for this aspect. No, we we planned every shot. We planned how everything would work out. And uh, if you want to see our video, uh, look in the description, and there'll be <clears throat> there'll be a URL. Click on that URL, and you can watch our stop motion. All right, thanks.